on to the story, we're just going to see how we can utilize ChatGPT to help us create a one great content. And on after that, we're just going to see how we can be able to detect if the content was created using an AI, using AI content detector. And from there, we just going to see how we can be able to dissolve that and make our content look like human-like. One thing I just do know is that sooner or later, or maybe it is started, you find such agent will start penalizing AI-generated content. ChatGPT is the one that we are going to use to generate our content. It has taken much uh, attention of many people for the past few days. It has been all over the internet. Friend, many people are talking about it and I found it will be good when we just we try and see how we can be able to create the content and we able to maneuver and see how we can convert AI generated content to look like human like and that's the tutorial for today and without further ado let's just get into action and I'll show you how so the first thing you just need to do you need to search for open AI here we have it you have you're going to use we have playground you can use playground also but i'm just going to use chat gpt because the one that is being mostly talked about and once once you're here i just need to do select uh try chat gpt if you don't have account consider creating account using sign up button and if you have account just click login i already have account then from there here we are you, we are directed to this page you may find some table that is prompting just click next 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 when you're here on this table you can see they have just given you some uh, examples of capability and some limitation if you just if you want to use some light mode you can just select here and convert you can be using light mode but I like to use dark mode then from there, all you just need to do is now search what we are looking for. Let's say we are just looking for something like SEO. Um, let me first of all try to find uh, a title. So I believe I have something here. So I will just tell the chat GPT to create a YouTube tutorial title with keyword chat GPT uh, AI con AI content detection create 10 I'll choose that the first one prompt we are just going to search for this one so you find it doesn't give us what you we want it just say chat GPT I generated com comprehensive and all that chat GPT AI content detection a comprehensive tutorial for so it doesn't have to explain much so I will Re paraphrase this one my title here so i just come back here i had already written so create a youtube uh, tutorial title with keyword i put in keyword into comma chat gpt ai or ai uh, content uh, create 10 i'll choose then uh, the topic is about how to avoid. I am trying to explain my title here. So uh, the topic, so we have the topic is about how to avoid detection of content created using AI. Then I ask the ChatGPT, did you understand? And I tell it, ask any question for more clarification. So I now click now to generate. So you find we are having some more different and more we're having more different more than and more of what you are looking for then we have uh, like for this number one they say avoid ai content detection on youtube a chat gpt tutorial yeah uh, we have chat gpt ai detection how to create a youtube content without getting flagged so you are not going to create a content but we are going to create uh, a blog content so this one we can customize this one and we also have uh, many of them so from here I let me choose this one here and I copy and I just give it this one I tell it light two paragraph on 
how to avoid AI content. You can even offer more clarification depending on the topic you are in. You can say maybe use a light intro to topic, to the topic. Uh -huh. And also add comprehensive and save light comprehensive uh, detail we ask question maybe if you didn't understand what you wanted it yeah so um, as a youtube algorithm because it advanced nee, 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 nee. so one of the most thing to keep in mind is avoid using a generated in a video title description so it is talking about now about our youtube so somewhere never or oh, to create no so here we never changed so it was a we could have changed here to say on our blog so you find it has written an intro here and three more paragraph to explain what we just needed and in summary here we have it so what we're just going to do is we copy this one and now we need to check for an AI. So I search for AI content detection. We have one you're just going to use is lighter. And I'm also going to use this free AI detector. And let me see if this one is a free one. So we are going to use this. Uh, this one is not a free one. So we have uh, content at scale. Let's see how and we have this one for right. So uh, what I'm just going to do is I paste the content here. So I analyze the text. So we have surpassed here with some um, to some. So we'll move this last uh, paragraph here, but we're going also to add it. So let's analyze here. You see that 3% is human generated. So let's use this one here and see if it will be able to detect. Check. It will take some, uh, you see here it say 0% lil, 100% uh, fake. We're just going to change on that. So what you just need to do, we need to get back here. We say, we tell it to lil light. Lil light using signal names and also paraphrase so and we paste our so like that so it will just what it will do now it will light it and it will paraphrase but it is good now after it has done it all you just need to do now is get back let's see if it will work i'm trying i've tried some it works some it have never worked so let's see if it worked for this one so let me copy this one let me get back here and so remember this one so let's see so you find 99 percent human generated let's see if this one will help will detect you see a hundred percent lil Google, Google maybe also have some way to detect it. So what you just need to do, I'll offer you this one here. So once now we have paraphrased everything here, all you just need to do is search here for Quillbot. I'll include all the link on the description on how you can be able to maneuver this one. So I use Quillbot here and I paste me it to have some limitation so you find we have more than 251 watts so i try to remove this one here so you find it will just it will just do a bit by bit so we paraphrase this one here so you see you all just need to do is delete it or it has generated and if you need to change like one word that look uh, somehow creepy all you just need to do is click on this one uh, you right click and it just give you more option on what you can choose then once you choose this one here uh, sorry for that once all you just need to do is get back here let's see if it just detect is an AI 
or if, if we have messed everything again so it is still main a hundred percent that with that i hope you have understood and you have been able to generate uh, a uh, generate content using ai and be able to maneuver from uh, being detected being detected that content was created using ai and being penalized for that you can use it to create uh, content for your blogs content for your post and all that and with that i it just look amazing i hope you didn't learn something out of this story if you didn't learn something after this story hit the thumbs up till next time thank you